You got you got you got away from it yesterday. I told you yesterday. If we are gonna win, uh, you have to ask the player not to make. Come on, they are. Well, we we already talked to the players. We already talked to Namir, but now now we have to talk to the head coach here of the Netherlands, Mr. Roberto Piazza, and coach. A big three nothing win against one of the other challenger teams here at the VNL. Three nothing over Cuba. How are you feeling right about now? I feel good now, really. I feel good because uh, it was a tough game. We knew before. Uh, it's a difficult tournament, this one, especially this group now. You know, four games, uh, and imagine that we had to play three games in a row. So yesterday, 4.30 against USA, today 11, and tomorrow 11 again. So this one, for me, was a crucial game. I'm happy. I'm happy before because the guys played uh, in a good way. But now I'm looking forward at uh, the next step. Yeah, N next step right off the bat. It was a quick turnaround yesterday from like less than 24 hours from yesterday's game to, to today's game. Yesterday's result obviously wasn't what you wanted, but how did you help change that mentality for, for today? A uh, big difference between the two, two, two clubs that we, we met. Yesterday, USA, we did really few, few, few mistakes. Today, we knew that Cuba, if you stay there, if you stay there, if you start to annoy them, they can do some easily mistakes sometimes. You don't know exactly when, but you know exactly that sooner or later one mistake will arrive. Against USA, no way. So I decided yesterday to immediately switch the, the mind to put immediately the focus on the next game and not the game of yesterday. Maybe this one was the key. Is it kind of nice to have a game against USA to kind of get into, get into it against really, really good competition before the, the bigger games, quote unquote, against such an other challenger teams? It's, uh, it's important to start with a strong team, sure, 100%. Now looking forward to, to the rest of the weekend. Serving today wasn't as great for, for you guys. Is that it? Especially the first set was a dis disaster. Yeah. No, it was not so perfect. Yeah. Yeah. What's... It, yeah, Germany tomorrow. What do you guys have to do to get ready for, for Germany tomorrow to serve tough against them? First of all, serve. Serve must be constant and not like today, up and down. And the second thing, today we miss some balls on transition that against Germany can be the key. One more time. Yeah, and absolutely. I don't think Germany will make as many errors as, as Cuba does, especially in transition. Exactly, exactly. How much of that, you know, you had a magical end of season run with Milano this year. It was, it was fantastic. Okay. It is in the past, but are you bringing some of that magic here to, to the, the national team with the Dutch? I would like to put something here in the national team, yeah, it's true. But not from the past, from, 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 uh, from now, when we started in uh, Rotterdam. We would like to create some new atmosphere inside the court, inside the team, and the team is, uh, is going good now. Last year, you, you guys were a playoff team in the VNL. You made it to the final eight. Yeah. Is that possible again this year? Who knows? We have to play as better as possible, and then in the end of the 12th game, we can understand. Well, coach, grazie for your time. Best of luck tomorrow against Germany. Thanks a lot. Thanks, guys.